We have made a lot of advances across, across the board in breast cancer treatment. One in particular is within breast imaging. So as a result, we're trying to improve what we do for patients. And, that, and, and at the end of the day, that's what all health care providers want to do. But we have to weigh out the cost and benefit ratio. And radiation exposure is something that we you know, can't take lightly. Unfortunately, we have this improved imaging, but we're also basing our imaging guidelines on older data that was for that studies that were performed at, in an era where maybe we didn't have some of that technology. So there, of course, is going to be a discrepancy between those results and what we perform today. It's also really important when we look at the outcomes for patients in breast cancer that we don't base it solely on when imaging was performed. We really need to be cautious about understanding that all of breast cancer treatment has improved. We approach surgeries different. And another important aspect is this, this, the systemic therapy. So as a result, we're having improved outcomes across the board. We've made a lot of advances with targeted therapy for systemic therapy modalities. And that obviously is going to contribute to the final outcome of patients.